afternoon, St. Cattery School. Let us begin as we begin all things, in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of your faithful, and kindle in us the fire of your love. Send forth your Spirit, and they shall be created, and you shall renew the face of the earth. O God, who by the light of the Holy Spirit did instruct the hearts of the faithful, grant that by the same Holy Spirit we may be truly wise and ever rejoice in his consolations. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. This morning I sent your families home a heart that looks like this. We're going to be working on creating a rainbow, and each grade level is coloring a different color. So if you haven't seen it yet, ask your moms and dads. If you don't have a printer at home, um, have mom and dad send me an email and I will print some out and get them home for you in your packets on Monday. So I had a lot of great predictions about what was the missing ingredients. Some people said it was the goose or the chicken. Some people said it was water. And one person said it was the carrot. So let's find out what the key ingredient is missing. So here's the soup. Oh, a key ingredient is missing. You. Well, we did try to warn him. The end. More soup, children? Mmm, they look like they're enjoying that soup. So if you go back to the very beginning, the fox and the duck or the goose see each other. And the words are, what luck, dinner. Excuse me, would you care to go for a stroll? Hmm, sure. That is not a good idea. So all along, the little chicks were trying to warn the fox instead of thinking that the mama should be careful. So I love books with surprise endings. If you have a favorite book with a surprise ending, let me know. I want you to have a great weekend. Keep doing your reading. Keep doing your praying. And be a PAX leader. Have a great weekend.